Hello friend and welcome to our YouTube channel once again. My name is Jimmy and this is my wife Jess. Card number three. What would you be your perfect weekend? What <laughs> would be your perfect weekend? My perfect weekend. Okay. My perfect weekend will be this day. Maybe I wake up in the morning and any any spending outdoors, <laughs> like outside the door at the house. I would want to wake up in the morning and um, travel out. Probably have a long drive somewhere in the bushes where I can go and see nature. You know, if I can drive to you know the let's say for example uh okay you may not know these places let me use kenya if you go to um if you go to like the nairobi national park go in there see those animals do what or go somewhere sleep camping and so on uh i would like to spend time with nature that would be a, during the day for example we have lunch down there in the evening of course i would want to be home early and uh watch series as always that's how <laughs> i love ending my day like that but i think my perfect weekend will be with friends not alone like i go out with friends uh, we enjoy ourselves in the nature um, swim enjoy doing these energy depleting activities <laughs> and rest then i come back home and finish the day with the series and the house chill with my drink slowly and i uh, finish it that way simple mm, okay i mm. see what, mm -hmm. so my perfect weekend would mm. be that weekend where um i just go out and swim Oh. I, I love swimming so mm -hmm. if i get a chance mm -hmm. with friends mm -hmm. go out and just swim the whole day actually mm -hmm. that i will call that a very perfect weekend for me mm -hmm. yeah now you'll teach me how to swim <laughs> you'll <laughs> pay me <laughs> now the last time i went swimming i remember it was 2000 and uh should be in five uh, it was in six i was in class five and that day my mom almost killed me you know the way she beat me when i came back home so you know i went swimming and i came home very late like <laughs> 7 30 and so on and she almost killed me and i saw i'll never go down there again because she chased me all the whole compound <laughs> she beat me up she i don't know you know she almost killed me short and i've i've become photophobic since then it's been about um 18 years i've never gone i mean any large water mass i've never entered inside <laughs> oh my dear yeah um, yeah so that, that's basically my life anyway i learned swimming soon because she's my wife and she loves um, swimming so i'll have to teach yeah. you mm -hmm. so i will flip this card the other side i've not seen the questions you have not seen the question yep. so i'll flip this card and ask her the same question so are you ready yes yeah. i'm always mm. ready <laughs> what are you most grateful for in the last five years what are you most grateful for in the last five years yeah. how many things do you want to name i can just name three okay go one is um the gift of a uh, husband mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah my husband mm -hmm. two is um the gift of serving with fellowship of christian unions focus, yeah. focus. Mm. specifically Nakuru Seus, mm -hmm. but also Africa International University, mm -hmm. serving under Omondi Siwa mm -hmm. Canon. But uh, also the that item that I'm really grateful is um, God keeping my family members alive yeah. and safe. Mm -hmm. And I am I am so happy for this. Mm -hmm. They are, they mean a lot. They mean world to me. Oh. Yeah. Wow. God, what am I grateful for in the last five years? There's so many things. Some of them are little, some of them are big. I don't know which one to mention, but um, yeah, I think I have I have grown a lot. The growth in my life has been big. I think one professionally, five years ago is 2018. A time like this, I think I was in STEM. Yes, I was in STEM. I just qualified as an art graduate. I was, I was about to graduate as a nurse. A time like this. I graduated 5th of December 2018. I was about to graduate, so I'm happy. I've been a nurse for five years now. <laughs> five years now. I look young though. <laughs> yeah. yeah. 
five years full as a qualified nurse so i'm happy about that i've progressed i've i've progressed i've done so many things as a nurse so far i outgrew myself in kenya and i moved abroad so i've still been doing abroad a, a lot here and still now so career wise i appreciate i am grateful the growth i've had as a professional and um, my profession has brought me abroad i'm working in england now i'm happy number two i'm happy family wise i have my own family this is my wife jessica and she's with me in england now uh, and uh, the same work i'll be doing as a nurse i've been able to earn a little money i'm sponsoring a few people to school and i'm grateful it's something i am grateful to god for giving me the opportunity and i'm also grateful for the opportunity to i mean i'm a believer now and um I got born again and I've grown and I think I've been growing as a believer and uh, the test uh, became a good test now after college because you know when you leave the CU is no longer there, the friends are no longer there. I appreciate the journey and I'm grateful God has helped me to stand alone and know how to manage myself and my journey alone. I'm grateful to that extent. I'm grateful also for family support. I think my family, my mom, my dad, my brothers and sisters, they've been grateful. I've been doing a lot of things. I just tell them I want to do this and oh, they're just like, you want to do it? Is it good for you? Yes, good, go ahead. And my parents also. Yeah, that one or two things. When you see when they, when my parents, you see when you guys ask me questions here and there and you guys have fear and I'm going there with confidence, whether it is stupidity that is guiding me or, or, or what, but you guys just say, you trust me, go ahead. I really appreciate your support. And I think now that I have my own family, I think my wife has been a good support system. I think since we were dating, I appreciate that. And above all, God, I think God has answered my prayers. Many of my prayers that I was praying when I was a student in college, God has answered most of them. And I know recently we've been sharing about that with my wife here. And um, yeah, God has answered most of my prayers. And uh, even the ones we're praying now, we have faith that he's going to answer. And at five years to come today, when we we'll ask, when we will be asking ourselves what we've been grateful for the last five years, I'm sure we'll be mentioning these ones now. But um, there are many things I'm grateful for that I don't know which one to say, which one not <laughs> to say. Yeah, the others I don't want to say them publicly. <laughs> yeah, but um, it's been good. That's what I can say. And let me ask you, by the way, what are you grateful for in the last five years? You, yeah. you, my friend, you, mm. you just <laughs> just comment down there. What are you grateful for in the last five years? Yeah. And um, and uh, how? What is your ideal weekend, by the way? You know, you don't know. Someone may see your comment down there and pick it for something good. <laughs> so, don't take yeah. this one li lightly. Mm. Just answer it nicely. And are you? Hey. Yeah. God is listening and is watching, so mm -hmm. it might just surprise mm -hmm. you. So please, please pick up my comments. <laughs> <laughs> I want to go swimming. Oh yes. How many like swimming and how many like outdoor activities like me? Yeah. Hmm? So pick yes. up and take me out still. Oh, you swim. want me to pick? Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll go. Mm -hmm. We'll go then. I've never denied you anything that yeah. you want. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's it, I think, for today. Yes. And we have another other many cards to go with. So See you in the next video. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Mm.